We're going to look at how to measure the current and voltage in a series circuit. Here I have a series circuit with my AA battery. A uh, positive terminal comes out here, flows through the green resistor, continues on through the blue resistor, and comes back around to the negative side of the battery. And this is the conventional uh, current direction. Of course, you know electrons flow the opposite direction. If I want to measure my voltage across the battery to get my battery voltage, I have this set on DC uh, 20 volts and the leads are in the bottom two um, sections on the voltmeter. And I can touch my leads on the opposite sides of the battery and I get 1.14 volts. Obviously this battery is getting uh, low. I can also measure on these two leads here, I get 1.14, 1.15 volts. Uh, this is the same as measuring across the resistors and it's the same as measuring across the battery because when we measure across all of the resistors of course the total of these has to be the battery voltage so there's no difference. To get the voltage across one battery I measure across from one of these leads to the other so the blue is 0.77 volts and the green is 0.37 volts Together those two should add up to the 1.14 volts uh, plus or minus that last digit. And that's how we measure one resistor, the other resistor, and both resistors for voltage. Now current is different. Current, we must be in the circuit. So the circuit has to be completed by going through the meter. So the first thing I'm going to do is set the meter to 10 and I'm going to move the positive lead up to where it says 10 right here. Now measuring across here won't do me any good because what I'm doing is I'm measuring the short circuit current across here. So I'm not measuring the same way that I would measure voltage. Instead I have to open my circuit which I'll do down here and now there's no current flowing at all unless I make it flow through the meter. So I have 0.7 amps of current flowing through right now. Now of course since this is a series circuit if I were to unhook this and check it over here I should get the same 0.7 amps. The current is flowing out through the positive lead through the green then it must flow through the meter here in order to get uh, to the other side and continue on. It doesn't matter where I measure, I'm still going to get 0.7 as long as I am unhooking the circuit and forcing the current to go through the meter. That's how we measure the current. So all of these get me 0.7 now if you use your meter and you do something silly like this and you get this number or like this you're short circuiting the battery by creating a continuous circuit which comes out of the battery goes into the meter here through the meter comes back here and then goes back into the battery this short circuit will read a large number of amps fortunately with this low battery it's less than two and the meter can take up to 10. But I'm short circuiting the battery here by making the voltage go, making the current flow through the meter. And that's bad. To measure current, you must open the circuit and complete the circuit with the meter. So we have 0.7 amps. So that's how to measure a series circuit.